Okay, Alex, bring us in our picks. I want to hear your intro with saying, don't read, don't go totally off script. Go. All right. Coming off of the NFL divisional round, we're in championship weekend. Saints hosting the Rams. Pats on the road at Arrowhead. I'm going to kick it to the losing side of the <laughs> table first since Jay and I were on point. Yeah. Lamar, please lead us off your thoughts on championship Sunday. I can tell you this. Home teams in the conference championships are 10-0 and in the last five years. 8-2 and against the spread. So that will tell you where I'm going to go. Easy decision. Easy peasy, baby. So, let's hear it. Two home teams. Okay. So we get it, that we would get be it for the sound Kansas right City there, and New Orleans. Can we just get that for the second? Can you just say, I'll take the two home teams? And... I like the Saints minus the points. Okay. And I like the Chiefs minus the points. There you go. There you go. Brett? I just, first of all, I want to say that is the best intro you've ever done. And you, after three shots of commissario and you chased it with whiskey. Yeah. Um, I think we I think we we figured out uh, formula. Yeah, the yeah, formula, the formula right. for for Alex's professionalism. We're gonna need you to show up a half hour early every show. <laughs> Probably <laughs> get you primed. I, mean, I want to give you a nickname, Everyday Ernst. Give us your two picks. I was about to, but that's okay. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go with uh, what Lamar said. I, I, I'm going with the two home teams. I'm gonna take the Rams. I'm at the the Saints minus the three, actually three and a half. Three and a half. And I'm going to take the Chiefs minus the three. And I would also, I don't know if I'm going to mess with the over and under because they're very close as well, right? It's uh, 56 and a half for, for the Rams and Saints. I would take the under on that game. I, I think that the defense, I think McVay's defense is, is going to play tough. I think both I, the defenses are going to I 100% tough. agree with that. If, I, if you said you got to pick one game to be like your lock for the week, uh -huh. go under in the Saints game. I would say under the yeah. Saints and yeah. then... I think the over and under for, for the Pats, I think it's going to be a high-scoring game between Mahomes and Brady. But what do I know? Because I was 0-3 last weekend. Even in Arctic temperatures? Huh? Even in Arctic temperatures? Yeah. Yeah, this number has dropped almost three points in the last four days because of the Arctic temperatures, which is kind of ridiculous. The wind's going to be about 10 miles an hour. That's the only thing that really, really. Well, you said hurts. wind. When you, when you were saying what, what really factors in to home, wind. is wind is everything, right? right? So th the fact that this is dropping is, I think, a false move, you know, in the Kansas City game. So are July you saying, pick? no, please, yeah, go yeah, ahead. Please, Segue yeah. in, but so you're saying don't touch the under or over on this? No, I, I would say I wouldn't let the cold influence whether you think it's going to go over. If you like the game over, like if it was 70 degrees, I, I would think you would still like it, right? Because the only thing that's really going to be difficult is is the wind, and the wind is not going to be much of a factor. Okay, so yeah, so then then it's safe that is to you say well either way. I don't have an opinion on that, uh -huh. but I, I would say I wouldn't let the cold you know, influence you into betting the under. I'm okay. fascinated at the over-under between the two games. One's in a, one's in an Arctic chilled environment. One's in a dome. They're one point difference. Well, I mean, uh, based off of what you saw of the Patriots last week, they, they put up 44 in basically the same conditions. Wow. So, Again, Jay, I, I'm, I'm going to go oppo of you guys. I'm going to actually take uh, both road teams. Wow. Um, and take the points here. and Because I think all these teams are fairly close to each other. And when in doubt, take the points. Before the commissario really kicks in, I'm going. Let's finish this. I'm thing. going with the Pats with the points. I actually have them to win. I don't care that they're one and five in Arrowhead at all time. So I you're taking the Pats in the money line. I'm taking or? the Pats in the money line. You know the Pats last won a playoff game on the road was 2004, championship game. That's because they're always at home. Exactly. But but has what have they that ever for? had bet against us T-shirts sold during that week, Lamar? They have not. I'm going with my Wait a minute. Judgment. Wait a minute. Bet against us? Yeah. They've been favored in every game except for two games. And here they are, not favored. Bet against Brady. I and they lost the last time they were underdog on the road Anyways, in the playoffs. Look, the difference in age between Brady and Mahomes is the difference in age between Brett and I. I'm going with the veteran. Easy decision. And then I'm taking the Saints. Why? Because the Rams are 1-4 in, in these championship games in the last five. And Breeze and Peyton are six and zero, oh, and the Ra and the Saints have won seven straight so in the Super Bowl. The Dome. Rams are in one and four in what? In champion NFC championship. And, and how games. far does that go back? <laughs>